up, guys? David Lewis Parkai here to talk about Game 5. Celtics take it 106 102, but you can't be disappointed with a game like this. It's played their hearts out. They had a great surge at the end there. It was a terrific game. It had everything technical fouls, dunks, black shots, steals, three pointers, mid range, breakaway layoffs. It was just great. Great game to watch. I salute the Pistons. Great job. Did basically what you had to do. It was a great game. Unfortunately, came out just a little bit short. So, we're going to head back to Detroit for game six. Hopefully, the Pistons are going to get the dub. A couple things I want to talk about. First of all, the nine call on the Paul Pierce tackle. That was the most bull crap I've ever seen. Borderline ejection. He didn't get a break or a flagrant foul call, but it was definitely, you know, a, a call that could have gone to an ejection. And that's just horrible. It was, it was a really bad call. Should have been ejected. Paul Pierce should have been done. And they did much in the fourth quarter anyway, but great game nonetheless. How about Kendrick Roly Poly Pierce going off? What do you have, like 17 and 16? What a joke. He's a freaking bomb fence. But anyway, now a great job on the follow-up, big guy. You really are a consistent player. Coming off 21 and 16, you foul out, score four points, and grab five rebounds. That's what I like to see. Freaking joke from you tonight. But hey, I still love you, still have a lot there. So, um, Billups had a good game, Hamilton had a good game, she was on fire from the Great time, great game. Unfortunately, the Pistons came up short. Watched it over at Damon's. I'm proud to say I watched this game with my buddies. It was a lot of fun. Just didn't quite get the dub. But um, hopefully we get it next time. Game 6, Friday night, back in the D. Get the job done.